Hello YouTube, this is Bad Gunner here, and this is the review of the Beats by Dr. Dre Tours. Sorry, it's kind of dark. Let me turn this on real quick so you can see this better. It's Beats by Tours. They're whites. They are fake from iOffer.com, and I just got them today and I wanted to do an unboxing yeah it says 2009 right there if you can see it if it's focusing too well but this is my new phone the HTC Evo V4G <clears throat> and there you go the face is faded just like most fakes came in uh, just a bubble wrap packaging this time in the parcel like most of them but it was just bubble wrap, so yeah. Under the headphones, I've already taken them out of the package, and they came with the standard case, the zipper. I'm doing this one hand with a cell phone. Sorry, it's kind of hard to unzip something circular with one hand. And there's the case. It's kind of nice. Feely inside. It's not like most real cases, and this is kind of out of line. But it came with six different pieces. Six, and it came with the standard long ones like that too. That makes them look real. In the box, it didn't look too neat either. It didn't even come with everything. I'll just open up the box real quick. Sorry, I don't mean to be shaking the camera. I'm taking this box, opening it. Okay. As you can see, it came with just these two little things. The warranty manual, and it was really dirty. I mean, it was really dirty. I wiped it off a little bit to look at it. I don't know. Some of these fakes come with... Yep. It came with the right one. Some of the fakes come with manuals for different ones, like the Power Beats. And that can be a problem. So, right now, I'm about to tell you about how they compare to the Power Beats, which are over here. Right here. These are the Power Beats. I'm going to plug the phone back in. It's running on low battery, but I wanted to do this video now. And let me open the Power Beats so I can show you what these Power Beats look like. But these are real Dre Power Beats. I'm kind of going to make this a little bit of a long review because I wanted to tell you guys about it. Because a lot of people have been wanting to get these beats because $150, I really think they have the same same sound quality as the real. Beats by Dre Power Beats, which had the same sound, 10 millimeter sound driver, as this. <clears throat> they are practically the same. They sound the same, but the only thing is, this is sorry, it's dark in here, so it's gonna glare. So I'm gonna try to show it like this. It's just painted on there, if you can see it, which kind of makes it gay. But this looks real, the monster part of this. It says monster on there. Sorry, you can't see it again because I got to use flash. It's gay. It's dark in here. And it comes with the serial number on there that usually isn't on there, right here on real ones. Case just doesn't seem as sturdy as the real one either. The real one's really hard. This one's just kind of kind of feels like you can press it in with your thumb and if I dropped a book on it or something it feels like it might break my headset. Thing is it also came chipping a little bit on the top of this one and it's paint ch chipped a little bit. That's not a problem. I have paint set over there. I can become an Asian real quick and paint them myself so yeah this was my review on the Dr. Beats by Dre 
This is Bad Gunner here. There's nothing really else I could say. This is just the review and showing how the box quality is and how I think they are compared to other headsets. Goodbye.